How's that for an introduction? Hello everyone, I'm Otto Strouch and I will briefly explain why our drum cutters are so unique and sought after by fiber artists all over the world. I will be covering the actual machine and will be highlighting the three features that are critical to a proper design. I will also cover some of the Carter's construction that benefits the end user. There are, are, there are other videos on our website highlighting how to use our Carter's to produce magnificent bats and roving. More presentations are on the way, so routinely visit our site to learn more tips and techniques. There are lots of other drum carters on the market. All of them do a good job for what they are designed to do, but none of them does it all. The Strouch is special in that it can handle any fiber, long or short, coarse or fine, and it does this without changing drums or adjusting spacing between the drums. They are truly universal carters. Furthermore, our machines are built with the user in mind. They do not require maintenance, no lubricating, no tweaking of adjustments. Just take it out of the box, screw on the handle, or plug it in depending on the model, and you're ready to start producing beautiful, thick bats. There are three important design features that make it all happen. Number one, the fine cloth on the large main drum. Pins do a great job of holding onto the fibers. The closeness of the pins allows for better straightening of the fibers, but due to this closeness, you need a way to push the fibers down in between the pins. Gravity is not enough. Enter the brush attachment. The properly designed stiffness of the bristles and the position of the brush on the carter are ideal for pushing the fiber into the carding cloth. Now, the most important part of carding is transferring the fiber from the in-feed drum onto the large drum. As I said previously, pins do a great job of holding onto the fiber. So why would one have pins on the in-feed drum? You don't want the fiber here, you want it here. We use smooth blades instead of pins. The blades open the fiber, precondition it, and transfer it onto the other drum. You can see this action by viewing many other videos on our website. Now, as far as construction, we use the best, highest quality components available. The benefits to you, the end user, is trouble-free operation. For instance, the frame is one inch thick ash. Baseball bats are made out of ash. The drum supporting blocks are heavy duty aluminum. The feed tray is galvanized steel. Any of the red parts are powder coated. They're not painted. This prevents chipping and corrosion. Stable and well-balanced drums due to the low friction of the chain allows for effortless turning. Oh, yep, and one more thing. Our, our open construction makes it easy to clean out stray fibers. So, have I made a case for our machines being built to last? If you want more specifics and lots of photos, or you want more technical information, pl please visit our website at strouchfiber.com. I trust that you have found this presentation useful and maybe even inspiring. I also urge you to do your research both online and among your fiber friends. We believe that an educated consumer is our best customer. You'll find that our customers are our best sales force. We hope to hear from you soon. Please do be well. Bye.